understanding and making the most of the flipped classroom technique. Hopefully, and no doubt, you are all getting used to the flipped classroom technique by now. Your modules, whether they're 15, 20 or 30 credits, all require you to do some self-directed as well as teacher-directed learning over and above your contact hours with the teachers. This is really important to understand. A 15 credit module, for example, means that you're required to do 150 hours of learning time. 20 credits equal 200 hours and so on, because one academic credit is worth uh, 10 hours of learning. So that means you get the chance to do loads of extra working around your formal teaching input for each and every module. For so many of your learning experiences now during this time of COVID-19 and the various lockdowns, it means that your teachers are using this flipped classroom technique. That means they'll be providing work for you to study through, possibly a week or so in advance. You do that, and then when you get to the online sessions with the teachers, or possibly in a physical classroom, you've got time to do more of a workshop or seminar experience. So with your teachers providing you with materials to work through before your actual online session, it means you've got the opportunity to do that. Then when you do meet online, they won't have to do a formal type of lecture with you, but you've got more of an experiential opportunity to share your learning with each other. Here's wishing you every success with your flipped classroom uh, approach to learning. Remember to take plenty of notes, Dot down any questions, uh, challenges, thoughts, reflections, and then you'll be able to share those during the online virtual sessions that you have with your individual teachers.